Let's hope they can. All right. We good to go? PD on demand. Here we go. All right. This is the uh, inaugural live event for PD on demand, not to be confused with Tech 20 Tuesdays. Um, Although we is, do endorse the sites. Yeah. Not as much as ours. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're just going to go over a few things with Link today. Uh, I'm the MC, but we have a, a co-host uh, over there, uh, Tim Lukey. He's with us. Should I back up? Not sound, but speakers are fine. Hmm. Keep trucking. Yeah, okay. All right, so uh, Tim's just going to start out by uh, walking through uh, some of the features. So if you want to share your screen there, bud. I'll just cancel out and uh, start walking us through. How are we doing? Anything? Are you sharing? Tim? There we go. Am I in? Yeah. All right. Uh, hi, everyone. Uh, what we're going to be doing is looking at uh, the uh, link program and oops when we actually go into the uh, link this is what uh, you'll see is your uh, uh, your avatar if you had one and there's a color profile on the side which is indicative of uh, your your status now what I've been encountering are individuals that don't know if they have the link or not and everyone does in the school district so if you go and click the uh, corner start icon and just type in link, you'll see where it comes up. That uh, may be very basic for a lot of individuals, but anyways, that's just where you'd find it. Uh, as you can see, I have a, a bunch of contacts that I've pinned as such. And if I was just to uh, glass over uh, Robin Leroy here, it uh, gives me an update on uh, what's happening, what's there. And on the bottom are options of uh, sending an email to her if I wanted to, or to give an instant message. There's also the option to uh, do a live sync call, which is what we're going to have with uh, Phil and uh, Mark Bates, who's uh, here as well. And there are more options for interacting, having the video call that we uh, have going, and I'm assuming everyone can uh, see the uh, video at the moment. Uh, there's also an option to get your location changed. So if I was at a different location, I can just put in office and click in and my status is updated as such. And on the center option, there's the also the posting of where we can uh, just give us our status if we're away, busy, do not disturb, off work, uh, etc. Now, if you want to find a contact, all you'd have to do is type in uh, an individual's uh, first name or last name. If I wanted to uh, find uh, Principal Mr. Morgan at Harborview, I type in last name Morgan. I'd find him there, and I can pin him as one of my contacts, and I could uh, call him if I uh, had a call for uh, Mr. Morgan. And just as a side, as we're going through the uh, live link, uh, there's also the option for us to uh, post messages as well. If you have any questions, feel free. If people wanted to uh, take their uh, microphone off of mute and ask a question live, feel free to uh, do that as well. And uh, what else do we have? I'm going to pass it back over to uh, Phil now. I'm going to click uh, Stop Sharing. And uh, because Phil began the conversation, he's going to be uh, handling it from uh, here. And again, welcome to everyone for our first uh, PD on demand, our, uh, our launch here. It's nice to see uh, so many people here. Okay, um, I'm going to just show you the ins and outs of just a, a general call. Um, so I'm actually going to start a conversation with uh, Mark Bates. And when I do, um, I'm going to put essentially uh, this call on hold. You guys will still be able to hear each other and see what's going on. And uh, Tim's going to do the play-by-play -play while uh, I have uh, or show you the features and functions of just a general link conversation, what you can do with that. So um, let's just bring up the actual 
link menu here and there's Mark Bates. I'm gonna double click on that. And uh I'm just gonna start a simple Hello. So you can IM and it doesn't get rid of your conversation, but now if I want to start another call, I'm gonna put this one on hold. So uh, I'm gonna pass the torch back to Tim and I'm just gonna show you some of the features here. Hello. What's up, buddy? See, Mr. Armstrong, join. hello, Keith, Teacher of the Year. Nice to have you on. <laughs> You're making us all look good, you know, Keith. Right on. And again, if someone has a question and they have the microphone, feel free to ask or type a message in.
How are we doing, Phil? Doing pretty good. I guess because there's other, there's other features here with um, whiteboard where you can just basically use it as a whiteboard to have a conversation. Um, there's a, a polling option. kind of almost works like uh, smart sync, just like the options you have there. You put the question here, put some of the, the choices here, and then people have the chance to respond. So, um, I mean, it's, it's really quite simple. How about, uh, how is everyone's day? Gloomy or lovely? Bam. Send that out. And it already has the radio button as I don't want to vote. Got 100% here. So I just voted. <laughs> lovely. Gloomy. I guess that has something to do with the weather outside. <laughs> That's just St. John. Awesome. But other than that, it's pretty straightforward unless we have any questions. I think that's pretty good. Um, it's just a really simple way for us to kind of connect into your classroom. And from my own experience, uh, I've been able to jump into a classroom in River Valley and do tutorials and um, actually take over a teacher's computer and uh, using SmartSync take over a student's computer. So being in control of two computers, uh, all made possible through Link. So there's a lot of uh, a lot of possibilities with this. And uh, the classes that I had uh, kind of linked into when I was walking around the building next, they all knew my name and they all knew who I was, and I hadn't even really seen any of them yet. So it's a, it's a powerful tool that you can use and that uh, the mentors can use and teachers can use. So we uh, did record this session, and uh, you'll be able to uh, view it as a webcast on our uh, District Aid Tech Mentor uh, PD On Demand site. So feel free to check that out, uh, tell friends. And uh, if you have other suggestions or if there's a uh, need somewhere, uh, just please uh, email one of us, tell one of us, and uh, we can uh, even get you involved in this, uh, in this whole PD On Demand project. Let's get this line up here. So thank you, everyone. <laughs> Phil, last thing to share? Uh, basically, just uh, make sure that if uh, you want to check anything out, go to our PD On Demand blog. Um, there's different categories that we've uh, we've put up there for uh, whatever you teach, so you don't have to be part of a demonstration school. Um, if you're interested in creating your own blog or wiki, or if you're a math teacher, if you are interested in using smart products, uh, just go to pdondemand.nbed.nb.ca and uh, check out some of the uh, the videos that we have there. The latest one was put up by our very own Tim Lukey on. Uh, Google SketchUp, which is becoming uh, popular in uh, different classrooms right now. But other than that, I think uh, we're good for the, the first live event here, unless there's any other questions. All right, signing off for Mark, Mike, Tim, and myself. Thanks, everyone, for joining today. Have a good evening.